God's overall desire is to get the greatest number of free will souls into heaven. God doesn't just show himself to everyone because that would defeat the purpose of his tests. American slavery was not biblical. It was not ordered by God, but God did use it for the good especially for future generations. The Bible is against stealing. Many tribes men were captured and sold by their own people. God's people also became slaves by Egypt and Babylon for disobeying God. These are the main differences between worldly slavery and God's slavery. When people were mistreated, they were allowed to run away. Don't return a runaway slave. Let him live wherever he wishes. It goes on to say to take care of them. Why did God allow his people to have slavery? One, poor people sold their labor for shelter and food. Two, it was a punishment. God punished nations because they would sacrifice their babies to Balaam in the fire and do other horrific acts. God would send holy prophets to warn them to repent, but they'd kill them also. They were all about the lust of their flesh, using even animals to fulfill their lusts. They definitely broke the Ten Commandments. These were some reasons why God gave Israel up as slaves to Babylon, Neo-Assyria, Egypt and others. But I'd rather be humbled by God or forced to learn about His ways than to go to hell. Atheists, however, have no moral high horse to sit on when judging the Bible. Absolute morals do not exist if nature is all there is.